Well, hello guys and welcome back to the channel and today I bring you the long-awaited this week's chapter of One Piece 848 of its name Goodbye It's not a title that bodes well, but we'll see My god, I love these costumes I love this cover arc The cover, not cover arc, the cover page more likely. It's it's the jump cover page, actually. My god, I love these outfits. Next game, I want to see these outfits in the game. One Piece Pirate Warriors 4, if the game ever gets released, I want these outfits there. Anyway, let us start the chapter. I am very eager to read it. So let us go. Ooh. Oh. I like this style. Let me... Luffy's ver Luffy versus Yonko underlings and Sanji versus his father volume 83 packed with action and currently and currently in stores oh, okay so this is the release the adventures continue on an on the adventures continue on a color spread to commemorate the series 20th anniversary Jesus this year is full of excitement as well. Check the previous page for more information on additional future plans celebrating the 20th anniversary. Yes, okay, uh, since I can't read any sort of Japanese, yeah, the informations on the previous page are lost on me, so... Anyway, moving on, I'm sure... Okay, here we go, chapter 848, goodbye. So, now... Big Mom's Den Den Munshi is off as of the moment. And her kids are making fun of him, of Luffy and Nami. You gotta be kidding me. What sane person would dare to provoke Mama within her castle grounds? Luffy, we would, and he did. Shut it, fight me. <laughs> oh, Luffy. Hey, my brothers, yo, dad, dad, dog, <laughs> I don't even know how to say this. And apparently the kid's name is Anglias, Ang Anglais, Anglais, it's English, it's French for English, actually. There is an intruder, an, intru an intruder in the treasure room, dog. An intruder. Yeah, that. Also, I ain't brushing my dent in tonight. What the hell? Oh, God. Totland, the Queen's room. Aren't you gonna get mad? Just because some little punk tried to provoke me not in a million years. Think about it, Zeus. Tomorrow I'll be getting my hands on both Gurma and the Tamatebako. Yeah, that will explode right in your face. On top of it, I'll be getting some stupid, sublime wedding cake to snack on. I would go for some wedding cake right now. Any of you guys getting married? Invite me. No, just don't. <laughs> don't. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Precisely so. Knowing that it's all going down tomorrow, I feel like I can forgive everything in the world. There's not a single reason to be in a sour mood. Tomorrow will be be the best will be the best what a happy day to be <laughs> i'm getting it oh so the 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 hat works like a a radio <laughs> something like that mama seems like some intruder is making a ruckus in the treasure room region and intruder there better not be after my tamate <laughs> She only cares about the tamate <laughs> Who the hell is it? Yes, room, Sanji's room. Get it together. Luffy and the others will be spared. Big Mom promised. Arati will be fine as well as long I as I proceed with this marriage. It's truly painful to part ways with my friends, but nobody will die. This is the most important thing. I have nothing to be disappointed about. Well, Luffy is not in a very sweet spot. The Barati is safe for sure, but Luffy and Nami aren't exactly swimming in a sea of roses. I shouldn't be looking this glum or Puding Chan, my only ray of hope, will get anxious again. 
I'd be a sad excuse for a man if I did anything to make that girl unhappy. Damn right you would, Sanji, my boy. Damn right you would. Don't hurt her again. There it is. Be your usual self. That's right. I am a cook in love. Pudding Sham, my old oh, sweet Pudding Shuan, I swear to make you the happiest girl alive. There's the Sanji we know and love. But still, deep down, we know that he does not truly love her. Lola's, yeah, I hear that the female had Lola's river card, which is why the homies couldn't lay a hand or, on her even within the forest. By the way, Mama does not approve of the dress you chose yesterday. Please wear the one she picked out for you during the ceremony tomorrow instead. Damn, she can't even choose her own dress. I mean, that's like a big deal for brides, isn't it? I mean, it's their special day. Therefore, they should be the ones to at least make the choice on what they're going to wear. Mama has planned out everything that needs to happen after the ceremony as well. Also, putting you'll never go wrong if you simply listen to my orders. You're just like a sweet little doll. Lady Pudding, careful, it's still raining in the garden. Oh, so she's she's remembering the day Lola ran away. Don't worry, girl, she won't kill me. We're family after all. I'll make sure I'll be the one to decide my own marriage. Yeah. I I think I know where this is going. And I think that none of us actually predicted this possibility, which is very, very cool. Within the whole cake chateau... Has anything been stolen? Treasury room security has been completely wiped out. The one responsible is in, is in possession of a bomb. Ooh. I like the his sword sweep. Almost, it looks almost like a claw swipe. It is, as he swiped this sword, it looks sort of like a claw swipe, which is cool. Pedro is really good. He wiped out the, the security of the of the treasury room. And yes, so fast he is indeed very fast. Whew. Jesus. I was eager to, to see Pedro fight, but Jesus. And there goes the bomb. <laughs> Where is he now? Downstairs. Jesus, it's cold. He's around the courtyard of the third floor of M. Baum. Plan to corner him in the garden swa. Roger. Baron Tamago, Lady Smoothie. You were right, there's a second intruder. The one you're dealing with right now is a mere decoy. I see that damn Pedro going all all out on us. He took us by surprise, managed to get inside the treasure room and, and has locked us out of the room. Can't you just blow the door? I mean, I can, I can assume that the door is strong, but she... <coughs> sorry, she's one of the three sweet commanders and to boot, she's a long leg. I had, I had not realized that before. I see, but knowing that the treasure room only has a single entrance, as long as you make sure to keep a sharp eye on that one entrance, there shouldn't be any problems with capturing the second intruder. Can't she, like, blow a hole in the wall? Like, I'm sure there are other ways to get into the room. I mean, Brooke can't possibly have barricaded the whole room, could he? I mean, good for him. Yes, success, but... Anyway, you're right, you can count on me for that. But if he defeats all the guards inside and gets outside, then I plan on killing him. Is that fine with you? Ha! But he's already dead! Ha! Ha! Anyway, all it, the man is nothing but bones according to you, correct? Mama will definitely want to head into her collection. Anything but killing is allowed. Well... There's definitely a lot less than before. Pedro's done a fine job. All my respect goes to the man. What a rare creature, even rarer than what you usually see around this country. I feel just the same way. Thank Mama will surely love this gift. I've heard from Pedro. Oh, 
the chess soldiers. Now we finally get okay that these barbarian chess soldiers are soldiers controlled by souls that mama inserted into their bodies. Okay. So we have basically we have soldiers uh, connected to each uh, each piece of chess. We have pawns, we have knights, bishops, rooks, kings, and queens. Uh, I would assume that there are only one king and one queen because that would make sense. But and by the way, where is Brook pulling that guitar from? Uh, I mean, if it was his violin, I would understand, but his guitar. Okay, anyway, in other words, you are you all are individuals that act based on what your soul tells you. Hold on, I'm not even done tuning yet. Rip him to pieces. Hold it, baby. Don't you know what I go by in the industry? Oh <laughs> they all call me the soul king. Oh, I love this. I found my thumb rail once again. I love this. Oh my god. It only makes sense that souls merely cast into the wrong bodies like yours have no chance of standing up against the obstinate nature of my screaming soul. Oh, this image is ominous as whole hell. I like it. Go forth, Brook, my man, go forth. Prisoner's library, so we have opera, standing guard, and Putin comes. Is it okay if I go inside for a bit to talk to Luffy and his friends? Okay. So he finds it a little bit strange that she knows their names, but anyway. I am inserting the bookmark. Oh, so apparently there's those bookmarks allow the pages to be controlled, or at least this particular page. It's it works like a key. Interesting. I, I I'm eager to learn a little bit more about Mondor's powers. Keep it down, Luffy. There are other people listening too. My brothers and sisters, they must have done terrible things to you too. I am so sorry. I am also incredible, incredibly sorry that I couldn't make it to the coast. Oh, and Sanji is picking flowers for her. Yeah, this is definitely going the way I think it's going. Sanji proposed to me. It made me so happy. But I also know that he only did that because he's a kind man. Deep down that I'm deep down I can tell that I am the one that's screwing everything up. So don't worry, I won't be marrying Sanji. <coughs> Listen, oh Jesus. Oh God. Yep. She's pulling a Lola. That's right. Pewding is pulling a Lola. She's gonna run away. Oh, God. A teary departure, a teary goodbye, and the name of the chapter, goodbye. Oh, God, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> She's pulling a Lola. I did not... I dare say that no one, no one thought Pudding would be capable of this. I certainly didn't. I, I thought of a lot of possibilities on how this saga could end. But I never predicted Pudding's departure, or at least attempt of departure. Just like in Dress Rosa, I predicted a lot of things. Never did it cross my mind that Sabo would appear. But indeed, he did appear. And now Pudding is pulling a Lola. She's going to run away. That's why we 
got to know the reason why Lola got away because it's going to repeat itself again. An important marriage of a very high importance to Big Mum and the daughter will run once again. Jesus. I don't know where this is going. I really don't. Big Mom might try to pull the blame on Luffy and Nami for this. She probably will. But how is Pudding going to leave? I mean, she has the fishman. There's Aladdin and the remaining fishman. And Jinbei, if you count Jinbei, who's currently missing. And Peckhams, who was most likely saved by Aladdin and the others. So I guess she has a safe haven there. Possibly. But what, what about after? Is she going somewhere else? Could she become in charge of Totland after Big Mom's defeat? Maybe. Imagine if Big Mom gets if Big Mom gets defeated, her whole crew goes down, and either she dies and the command and her sons get arrested. Not all of her sons, but like Mondor, Opera, Gallets, Moody, Crocus, Pero Supero, Brule. All the major sons we've been hearing about. The younger ones no, because if they if they stay at Pudding's care, they can still be educated into something better. But the oldest ones, the ones I mentioned now, I'm not gonna repeat their names again because it's almost a tongue twister in and on itself. But maybe Pudding can stay in charge of Totland and Totland gets to be a territory of Luffy. Maybe because that's really the only way I kind of see it going now. I mean, I say this, but then again, it was a week ago, it was another way that it was about to go down and then other comes and says, no, no, you know what? No, you thought that? Nope, here's another thing to completely destroy your idea and to twist it all up in, up in his feet and puring and putting is going away. This is going to be a good ending of the year. As I predicted, we will get to chapter 815 this year. Next week is chapter 849, which will probably be the departure of Pudding. I don't believe we'll see it on screen. And then chapter 815, 815 will be the, real, the general realization that Pudding has gone away. We will probably see Pudding about to leave and she'll probably come in, into contact with who is going to help her. Or something happens to her and we get we get worried that she might be in trouble, but then she's she's seen safe and sound with the fishmen. Because really, that's the only thing I can hope that the fishmen do, because they have not appeared just for the show. They will be important. They've already saved Peckhams in my idea. So I can't see any other reason for why they can't save Pudding. And then in chapter 850 will be the scene of the wedding. Sanji will be waiting and someone will appear and say, Miss Pudding is gone. And that's where 2016 will end for One Piece in chapter 815 with the realization that Pudding is gone. So, yeah. <laughs> Oda has a very good way to twist, to twist his story and to twist our ideas Oh God, I I did not see this one coming. And I haven't seen Luffy this worried in this saga yet. He's genuinely worried. Nami's just 
livid. She's just God. Oh Jesus. This is gonna be fun. This is going to be fun. 12 or 17 will be a great year. But yes, let me allow me to see the calendar. Yes, so today is no, this is still November. Today, December the 1st, December the 8th, and December the 15th. Yes, those will be December, December the 8th and the 15th will be the last days we have a One Piece chapter this year. So I am really eager to see what those chapters will bring to us. But anyway, you guys, I hope you have enjoyed it. This video was a little bit rushed, I assume. It's all it is. It's not. It's a holiday. You, I guess, yeah, out there you call it a holiday. We have a different name for it. But it's a day off in the week, sort of. It's the celebration of Portugal independence. Anyway, you don't need to know that. Uh, so yeah, I'm kind of doing this a little bit rush. I was preparing the Christmas tree. Happy Christmas month. It's not Happy Christmas yet, or Merry Christmas yet, but it's Merry Christmas month. Uh, have you guys started your decorations yet? Or if you don't celebrate Christmas, what, what do you celebrate? Please do tell me in the comment section down below, along with your opinions on this video, its quality and the quality of my performance overall. I hope you guys have enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next video.